Herbert was out taking a stroll towards his old home, the place he'd been tossed out of a few years ago. As he walked towards it, he watched the girl who lived here from a distance. She always had wondered what happened to him. He knew that from listening in on discussions he'd listened in on previously. She'd never been told the truth, but she had kept the Bible forever had dragged in his memento. As Perever approached his old home, careful to stay out of sight, he found himself by the old tree and went to climb it. As he did, memories flooded back. Hey, Perever, want to come play? Not today, Hizzyfoot. Why not? I plan on giving my owners a Bible. Perever, I understand Jesus' past is true, but we can't just try to convince our owners, said Hizzyfoot. Why not? We might offend them, silly. Now let's play a game of pounce. On the prey, she said as she held up a leaf. Forever got up from the old tree. Man, the smell of it still brought mem back memories after so long later after everything that had happened. Forever, a familiar voice asked, What are you doing here? Forever turned around and saw Hissy Foot, his former friend. I'll leave, said Forever as he slowly turned away. Wait! said Hissyfoot. What is it? I missed you forever. I'm so sorry for the actions I took a few years ago. Forever looked at her with a skeptical gaze. Things never boded well when Hissyfoot had apologized to him before. Hissyfoot, you've never meant it on other occasions, said Forever as he jumped the fence. Forget it this time. Oh, come on. If you're going to have history rewritten in your favor, we should make amends, she said sweetly. Forever jolted awake in his bed from his afternoon nap. He had completely forgotten about Hissy Foot, the cat who turned her back on him after having his kittens. She had talked him out of the Bible thing multiple times before he'd mustered up the courage to give his owners a Bible as an adult.